Hello and welcome to Adam About. In this video, I'm going to be talking about how hot tubs can provide genuine health benefits and can contribute to overall well-being. As you can probably tell today, I'm not actually in Plymouth. If you're following my channel, you'll know that I'm spending the summer sailing down the Atlantic coast of France. But actually, this is actually a very relevant place to film today's video, because it's all about relaxation. If you already own a hot tub, you'll intuitively know that they can help you relax and de-stress. This can help with your overall well-being and provide long-term health benefits. But is this actually correct? And is there science available to back this up? Lazy Spa have worked with Coventry University to complete lab tests to explore this subject and in this video I'm going to be taking a look at its findings and see what they say. And spoiler alert, it found significant cardiovascular health benefits. For complete transparency, Lazy Spa have been kind enough to support my channel and gave me the heads up on this research. But all the views here are my own honest opinions and this video is going to examine the findings. So let's get started and find out more. Historically, there's not been much scientific study into the use of hot tubs and its potential health benefits. However, now there has been some independent research conducted by Coventry University's Research Centre for Sport, Exercise and Life Sciences. They put Lazy Spa to the test and the results are really interesting. Two researchers, Dr Tom Cullen and Dr Doug Fake, from the Occupational Environmental Physiology Research Group, conducted multiple experiments using a Lazy Spa Mallorca with both the air jets and the hydrojets. They experimented with different temperatures, duration of time in the hot tub, and with the air jets and hydrojets turned both on and off. Under strict lab conditions, they tested 20 healthy participants, 16 male, 4 male, with an average age of 37. Each participant had three 30-minute sessions on separate days, but at the same time for each person, sat with their arms submerged in water. Researchers measured heart rate, blood pressure, blood flow, anxiety, salivatory cortisol, mood, thermal perception, and then followed up with a questionnaire. The first well-being benefit is one that comes as the least of a surprise, and that's hot tubs can help you relax. Specifically, the testing demonstrated that one of the best Lazy Spa health benefits is reduced anxiety. Research on the participants showed a 10.3% reduction, most notably a 22% decrease in salivary cortisol, which is a steroid hormone the body produces and is affiliated with stress. The researchers believe that there are two separate elements to anxiety and stress relief from using the Lazy Spa. The first is based upon the body's response to submersion in heated water. This is what was measured in the tests. The other is psychological response. Now this wasn't measured in the lab for obvious reasons, but taking time out from busy lives and simply relaxing peacefully and quietly in a calm environment, using the massage function of the hot tub and generally taking time out of your day to pamper yourself means you can disconnect and feel at ease. Now this is where it gets more interesting, as this is not so obvious, but the research found significant benefits to the cardiovascular system. Firstly, one of the assessments was on heart rate, which discovered that heart rate goes up when using a hot tub, likely a function of being immersed in hot water. The research showed that heart rates increased by 31 BPM on average, which is equivalent to a 30 minute brisk walk. The result is important as it demonstrates that using a lazy spa elevates heart rate and therefore could offer cardiovascular benefits to anyone less mobile or unable to exercise. Even if you are fit and healthy and get plenty of exercise, using the hot tub can actually add to your fitness compared to spending that same time sat on the sofa. The second cardiovascular benefit was that using the hot tub was found to actually lower blood pressure. The results demonstrated a significant reduction in blood pressure after spending just 30 minutes in Lazy Spa. Lowering blood pressure is significantly beneficial to anyone, but especially to those with existing heart disease, as it is associated with fewer heart attacks and strokes. 
Again, this is a function of being immersed in hot water and the results were as good if you used the air or hydrojets or just relaxed without either turned on. The third cardiovascular benefit is increased blood flow around the body. This was measured in the research by looking at the blood flow to the legs immediately after the 30 minute hot tub session. Blood flow to the legs increased by 345% on average, which incredibly is equivalent to a 30 minute jog. Good blood flow is essential for all your organs and overall bodily function. There's a brief quotation from the lead researcher, Dr. Tom Cullen. I'm just going to read it out verbatim. In modern society, people are often highly stressed and physically inactive, which can lead to poor health outcomes and increase the likelihood of cardiovascular disease. I'm interested in researching ways to improve people's lives through lifestyle modifications. Many of the normal lifestyle modifications such as exercise, dieting and smoking cessation are difficult for many people to maintain for a variety of reasons. Lazy Spa offers an excellent way of providing lifestyle modification that has many health benefits but crucially is something which people enjoy doing. This is very helpful information. My take on this is if you keep using the hot tub regularly, there's some tangible long-term health benefits beyond just getting to relax in your hot tub. One of the key caveats in the research is that the temperature of the hot tub is really important. Ideally, to maximise the impact, you should be using the hot tub with your arms and shoulders immersed for 30 minutes at least at a temperature at the hotter end of what lazy spa tubs can achieve. The research used 39 degrees centigrade and felt that the hotter the water was, the greater the benefit. The research went on to say that the massage functions did not necessarily add to the health benefits, especially the cardiovascular ones. So using the air jets or hydrates is not important to the health benefits, but certainly didn't detract from them either. If you personally find the massage functions helpful to relax and you enjoy them, then they're definitely worthwhile using. However, further to the previous point about temperature, the massage functions, especially the air jet, can reduce the water temperature in the hot tub. So if you want to keep the hot tub nice and warm, using hydrojets or no massage function is perhaps the better option. In conclusion, this research is a great start in scientifically proving the well-being benefits we intuitively expected from using a lazy spa hot tub. This is from both a cardiovascular perspective and a more general stress and relaxation viewpoint. If you ever needed an excuse to use your hot tub regularly more often, this really is it. If you did find this video helpful in any way, please consider liking this video and subscribing to my channel as it really does help me out. There are lots of other videos on my channel explaining how to use hot tubs and all the different chemicals, so please take a look around my channel for advice on all aspects of hot tub setup and care. Also, maybe take a look at my sailing videos as well, you might enjoy them. But that's it for today, thank you very much, goodbye. Thank you.